Hi everybody, Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan, innovation that excites. Way back in its early origins, the Fiesta Bowl was sort of viewed as a way to get a local team into the postseason. Those days are long gone. Some of the great stars in recent college football history have played in this venue and in this game. Another chapter will be written in this one in the Fiesta Bowl. That's going to do it for us here on the pregame show. NCAA Football 14 action coming at you right now. Fred Nessler and Kirk Herbstreit. Today we bring you the Tostitas Fiesta Bowl and what looks to be a high energy matchup. It <laughs> Scrambling around. Down. The 44 yard line. I like this wide receiver. He scrambled. Room around the corner. He's in the 30. And he's finally shoved out at the 19 yard line. So they get the first down on the quarterback scramble. Dan Broncos. And he tacks on the extra point. A 10 play, 69 yard drive. And it results in a touchdown. Five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Feeling the pressure and he fumbles the football. Tackle made around the 21 yard line. Yep, and this is why you need to know where the ball is at all times. Both offenses trying to find their rhythm in that first quarter. Low scoring and close right now. Boise State's lead is a touchdown. Boise State is up seven. Gets it out to him again. What a play, and that is first and goal. That's a big game there for the offense. And all that's doing is giving this quarter. Splits the uprights with the extra point. It was a seven-play, 51-yard drive. And they come away with seven points. Brad, I thought that was... They bring him down at about the 33-yard line. The game time. Set one of the most dangerous offensive weapons in the entire country under center today. This kid is really fun to watch. He's fun to watch unless you're a defensive coordinator. One thing's for sure... are coming. Great effort by this kid to get in there and make the sack. He's scrambling. He goes downtown. And he's taken down at the 20-yard line. That gives him the team's all-time mark for the season. converts the extra point. Caldwell on 
the right side. Nice run, and he's brought down. sack of this game. The Broncos taking their first time out of the half. Makes it to the 31. South Carolina's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Pressure. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Inside the 10. Huge play, and it's going to be first and goal. Well, that's another first down, Brad. Kicks up, and it is good. And that'll do it for the first half. Still plenty of football to be played. 21-3. Broncos. Seven, Got him in the screen play. He's tackled right around the 36-yard line. Wonderful play call to convert on third down. I'll tell you what, he really wanted that first down. Good determination to get. He's at the 30, and he's finally brought down at the 19. Touchdown, and they're not ready to quit just yet. the PAT. A 10-play, 78-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Now he tries to buy some time. He's going to air it long. Nice grab on the play. Spectacular play, and now it's first and goal. He scrambled. Quick throw. Touchdown, Boise State. And he adds the extra point. Well, that's a five-play, 77-yard drive. They come away with seven points. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I think the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. We head to the fourth. Boise State's up by 18. Some 
momentarily fumbles the football. Recovered by the defense. Fumble on the play. Recovered by the defense. Boy, the end really showed some explosiveness there in getting the loose ball. He makes the PAT. So a short three play, 82 yard drive. And that's good for a touchdown. You know, you always prepare your offense to think that we're going to have some success. These guys got to be coming over the sidelines after touchdown. Caught out of the open. He's tackled around the 48 yard line. This one's in the books, and our final score, Boise State, 35, South Carolina, 10. Let's get Kirk Herbstreit's final thoughts on this one. Herbie, what do you got for us? When you have two teams that are so equal in talent, the last thing you expect is a runaway game like this. I'll tell you, this margin of victory is shocking. Boise State won this game in emphatic and surprising fashion. I was expecting this to come down to the last possession, maybe even going into overtime. Instead, they just ran away with it. Here's a look at today's player of the game. For the Broncos, they rack up their 13th win of the year. And for the Gamecocks, this loss will put a damper on what's been a great year. 